Commonwealth Counseling Services has met backlash from concerned citizens in Coal Run as they attempt to build a sober living facility in the Village Street community. It was a good discussion. The, uh, the residents uh, voiced their opinions and uh, they're good and we're taking, we're weighing all opinions and taking everything into consideration. Grab up the Back to School Tech Bundle from Appalachian Wireless. Save up to $850 off. Choose from select iPhones in all sizes, iPad 9th and 10th Gen, and any Apple Watch with a two-year contract on the Mix and Match or Appalachian Advantage plan. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The facility, once construction has finished, would set less than a dozen feet away from the homes of several coal run families, many of whom attended the meeting to voice their concerns for living in such close proximity to the facility. Representatives from the Commonwealth Counseling Services spoke up to ease the worries of the Village Street residents and discuss their safety measures, qualifications for resident entry, and disciplinary actions they would take against misbehaving residents. I think the meeting went well as far as the purpose was for them to hear our concerns, you know, to just kind of be a voice, to let them know that with these rumors we kind of have issues, but we want to hear your side of the story. We want to come face to face with whatever's happening. So I do think we were heard um, as far as what will happen from here. I'm not sure. Despite some heated discussion, the meeting held many valid arguments from both sides. Ultimately, the citizens in attendance made an offer to the Commonwealth Counseling Services to buy the would-be facility from them in an effort to keep construction from moving forward. Stay tuned to Mountaintop News as the story develops. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Fidel.